Yo, what's going on guys? Arax here. Welcome back to the video for Tales of Arise. And in this one, I want to put together a quick guide on what to do with the secret key. If you have no idea what I'm talking about and you don't want any spoilers, then now would of course be a good chance to step away. But there is an item you obtain later on in the game called the secret key, which, surprise, surprise, opens a secret door. And in that door, is some cool stuff. So in this video, I want to quickly go over that. Again, if you don't want to see this, I would sincerely hope that you are not watching this video, but in the event that you do, then let's get started. First things first, you guys might remember earlier in the game when you are exploring Calaglia, you walk through the Trench of Flames the first time you go to attack Balsef, and there's a door there that you can't open, and of course that is for much later in the game. Then fast forward to later on in the game, when you defeat the boss in the Berg Volcano. I won't show you what that is, I can still let you guys enjoy that, but once you defeat that, you get the secret key. Following this, of course, you can then return to that door, and you can open said room. So as a reminder, if you want to do that, you then want to go over to the Trench of Flames, and you then want to select the Gates of Fire, and go to that fast travel point, and you then want to walk to East Side. Now, once you have the key, and you walk to East Side, Upon doing so, it will actually initiate a dialogue and it will begin a subquest. You then walk up to the door, you use the key, and then you go inside, there'll be a little dialogue. You have an interaction between the characters. Again, I'll skip that, you guys can enjoy that for yourself, but once you've done that, you will A, complete the side quest, and B, then have different chests to open. Of course, the two side chests just contain items of food, but in the middle, you then get three armor pieces. You have the royal cape, which of course is an item for Dorhalim. You then get the witch dress, which is an item for Shion. And you also get an Omega Elixir. So they are some pretty good items. Admittedly, by the time I went back and opened this myself, I had since outleveled the items and I had better gear. But assuming you do this at the uh, sort of natural progression point throughout the game, these are actually some good pieces of gear that will of course give you some nice defense boosts. So, there you have it, there's a quick little guide on what to do with the secret key and how to open the secret door. Hope you guys found that helpful, if you have any questions, by means let me know in the comments down below, but otherwise, keep it locked for plenty more. If you want to catch more from us at Arex Gaming, don't forget you can catch the guys 269 and Paradise Central streaming over on Twitch weekdays, playing a variety of games. If you guys want to jump in, tune in, watch and even join in, then make sure you check them out. The links to those are in the description box down below. And of course, you can join the Discord to get involved in all of the discussions.